We're going we're gonna to get back into movies really quick, and we're going to talk about a film that is doing some really phenomenal work right now. Like All deservingly. There, there's been a lot of talk about a film called Parasite. Now, if you've not heard of Parasite, no surprise. It's a, it's a smaller indie film that, unless you're sort of really following just like film and updates and things like that, like you might not have heard about it. Mm-hmm. Parasite is a foreign language film. It's, it's South Korean, and it debuted at, I believe it was the Cannes mm-hmm. Film Festival back yeah. in May. And so here's the thing about this movie. Like we're going to talk about it, but we're not giving away spoilers because this movie and this experience is best viewed as something where you just go into it blind. Don't even watch the trailer. No, seriously. Like, Don't even watch the trailer. Just go. If you do see this movie, we're just going to start off by saying like, go into it blind mm-hmm. or as blind as possible because you'll be rewarded so much more if you just don't know at all what to expect, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. Um, but again, it's a South Korean film um, and it premiered at Cannes Film Festival to widespread critical acclaim and now it started to roll out in theaters mm-hmm. um, more lately. It's come you know stateside and domestic it's doing pretty good work over here it's made most of its money internationally but here at the box office has made about four million that's compared to the 93 million that it's made overseas and yeah like i said it's it's doing amazing 99 percent on rotten tomatoes from critics 93 percent from the audience so on both sides people love this film right now we both saw this this past uh thursday mm-hmm. a few days ago we went and saw it when you walked out of the theater, what what were the first thoughts that ran through your mind after you saw the movie? Uh, so I said this with Joker, right? But Oscars for everyone. <laughs> Every individual. They, bo- they both can coexist and just get all the Oscars. Involved with this movie, you need a gold statue now. Uh, just at this. Now. Everything about this film was, it, it just made me excited for movies again, right? Like the writing, the acting. The even the cinematography, the, the, the music, it just mm-hmm. go see this movie. Yeah, it's, really, that's it. Is it? Is it the best film of the year? It might be. <laughs> I have to sit down and yeah. sit on it for a little bit just because mm-hmm. I'm still on the high from the movie, right? Like, yeah, I just seen it not even a week ago, so I'm still like really excited, and I still play the movie back in my head, and I think about all the layers of the movie, and I'm just like. It damn well might be because that's that's really kind of what I want to get to because like we don't want to talk too much about plot and what it's about yeah. and things mm-hmm. like that, but because it's so good, like it's such a it's such a good movie. Like I think like, I'm I'm sort of in the same place. Like I'm still kind of on a high from the movie. Yeah, I'm still on a high. From still that movie. sort of absorbing just like everything that happened and reading about it more and things like that. But I think it might be the best film of 2019 It thus far. It really might be. Um, And it's not it's not too many things coming up that even in my mind that can surpass it, right? Yeah. Unless it's unless it's something just like this. Like in in terms of of nowhere. Comes out of nowhere. Yeah. 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 But I think just from like the standpoint of the reason why I would say that it's probably the best movie of twenty nineteen. Like if somebody were to ask me that right now, I'd probably say yeah. Um not only does it successfully managed to essentially tell a family drama that's Mm -hmm. kind of as much as i can give you about the story yeah it's a family drama but it blends so many genres all of them and it does so successfully i think Um, actually literally almost every genre you can think of except like animation no seriously yeah it's in there it blends so many different genres and it, it 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 does It does so, but not at the expense of any sort of character development, Mm -hmm. not at the expense of the runtime. It doesn't sacrifice anything to successfully pull off what it's essentially like a cinematic juggling act. How many things are happening in the story that you sort of have to keep track of, but you never you never feel confused. You never lose sight of like what the actual story is. Mm -hmm. Um, And just, you know, the themes that are present in the movie um, are not necessarily themes that everybody can relate to but there are a couple of things in there that i think people can relate to just certain themes as it relates to like society and where people fall in society and just all of these it's, sort of ideas right ooh. it tackles them so successfully but it's never preachy yeah and it's never on the nose yeah. it, it's it's things that you you realize it as it's unfolding like this is what i'm watching like i see what the story is trying to say mm-hmm. and i see 
it's almost making an, an, an indictment of, of, of a certain lifestyle, right? But it's never preachy. It's never on the nose. And it just, I mean, it handled everything so beautifully. And it's fun. Yeah. You know, it's a really fun movie all it's throughout. It's fun. Like, you're, you're invested from you're invested. the beginning into the characters, into the story, and then just how it unfolds. Like, yeah, the, the genres, like the comedy, right? There's a lot of comedy in there, there's too. There's a lot of comedy. You know, and there's not, even though it's like a foreign language film, I don't speak South Korean. Like, right. I'm not familiar with that at all i never felt like i could not relate to the characters right. you know i felt like that mm-hmm. i would still successfully like i understood them i understood the points of view and even like the tension i think it probably achieved that better than anything else in the movie just like yeah. the tension that built and built over the story like so many things happen that lead to like this this climactic sort of crescendo at the end of the movie where you can feel like things are going to explode and when they do it still surpasses your expectations. Yeah, you're still like, oh, okay. <laughs> like, what did I just oh, see? Oh, that's what happened. Yeah, like, what did I just see? Because I still didn't see it coming. You don't see the end coming. Like, you don't know what's going to happen. Yeah, it's just good. Yeah. I don't have much to say, y'all, to be honest. It's just good. Just yeah. go see the movie. No, seriously. And we could talk about spoilers later. That's what I want to talk about. We can't, but I can't talk about spoilers. Yeah, maybe maybe, maybe, maybe on a either a special episode or a later episode, like once it's been out for a while. Yeah. Or, you know, I, I'm sure, like, it's going to it's gonna get... um. Academy Award recognition, all the major awards, it's definitely going to get recognized. And so yeah. maybe like we'll do like an award special episode and just like s- sort of highlight some of those films that we can dive in deep into what it is. But yeah. I think for now, because like it's sort of, it's, it's still making its way around, mm-hmm. like word of mouth is spreading. We don't want to give anything away, but obviously can't recommend it enough if we're, if we're both saying that it might possibly be the best film it, of the year. It just might. Go see Parasite, y'all. Yeah. And I know it's hard to see right now, specifically in smaller cities, right? Just keep your eye out. I'm sure in maybe within the next month if not two months parasite will make a way mm-hmm. um to your theater yeah for sure probably around christmas we'll start to see yeah, it like probably more around showings. christmas yep. um like people are going to be on the holidays and like at home and stuff have more time to see movies so go yeah like you said go see it like asap it's it's totally worth it you'll walk out glad that you saw it for sure very much glad so 